Hey guys, this is Drew with Acoustic Collectibles. Welcome back to a brand new video. In this video, we'll be talking about one of the greatest coin shows we've been to in a while and when it's happening, and also give you a, kind of a little backstory about how we found a coin that's now worth over $2,000. Let's get this video started. Before we get started, I want to let you guys know that we are sponsored by the Tyler Coin Show to make this video. And this video is not really just to gloat about them, but it's really just to talk about our experience on a genuine level. Was it a good show? And should you go to it? That's basically what they asked of us. And so we're going to be leaving you guys some details on screen of when this coin show will be, um, what you guys should look forward to. Um, I think that a lot of shows um, in Texas um, don't really match up to this show just because of where it's placed and we'll go through that here shortly. So let's bring you guys along and show you guys a few interviews um, of the president of the Tyler Coin Club and also give you a few other perspectives as well on what to expect because I think um, having a holistic approach to everybody that's coming and uh, their thoughts about the coin show would really help you and I hope you enjoy these interviews. Okay, everyone, I am at the TNA show in Arlington, Texas with Richard with New Life Coins. Richard, could you introduce yourself and your wife, Dee Dee? Yes, sir. Uh, Richard Graham with New Life Coins. This is my wife, Dee Dee Graham with New Life Coins. So it's, it's my understanding that you are the president of the Tyler Coin Club. Can you uh, give us some, some information about the upcoming show in August and uh, some of the great perks that the public should know about? Okay. Uh, I am the president of the Tyler Coin Club. I've only been the president for three months. So the greatness of the Tyler show really does not reflect on me as much as it does the people that put it together and the club itself. Um, I talked to a dealer yesterday and he was pretty excited about being able to be a part of our Tyler show because there's a quite of a list to get on, uh, the waiting list for dealers to get on that show. And the reason is because it's one of the best shows in Texas. Um, the person that's heading up the show is David Holcomb. He's probably one of the best coin dealers in Texas. And so he looks at the show from a dealer's perspective and also from a consumer perspective. That's one of the reasons that makes the Tyler show as great as it is. Another another thing is is that we don't make a profit on the show. Every penny that we get from the dealers goes into advertising. We advertise on billboards, uh, yard signs, internet, mail outs, and it really is one of the greatest shows in Texas. Another one of the things that make it such a great show is the enthusiasm of the members. We have lots of great members that really uh, look forward to this show and participate in this show. So we have a lot of involvement in the show. All together, to me, it's one of the best shows in Texas. So aside from the wonderful security that you guys have, the great venue, the clean facility, I think the most important part and the best part that Drew appreciated and I appreciated when we went to the show was the Lord's Prayer and the Pledge of Allegiance. Can you can you talk about uh, why you guys have initiated that? We created a video a few weeks ago when we said that that is a, a key to having a great show. Can you give us some uh, explanation behind that? I totally agree. Um, I am very much a Christian man, and if you involve the Lord Jesus Christ into your efforts, then it just makes things a whole lot better. Um, like I spoke to David Holcomb earlier, he is a Christian man also. The integrity and the values are there. And um, we just love the Lord and we just love coins. Sounds like a wonderful, uh, wonderful show. Wonderful team heading it up and I look forward to seeing it in August. Uh, thank you, Rich, Richard, for your time. And uh, Miss Dee. Hello everyone, we are at the TNA show with Chris, the ONA president. Can you introduce yourself? 
Yes, my name is Chris Harrell. I'm the ONA president. Uh, it is Saturday morning. We're getting ready to get kicked off here in about, oh, probably about 10 or 15 minutes. It's, it's my understanding that you guys are going to be at the Tyler Coin Show in August. Uh, can you give us your impressions about the Tyler Coin Show and how it's treated you and uh, Todd, your business partner, in the past? The, the Tyler Show is one of my favorite shows to go to. Um, obviously, I know the guys that put that show on, but they do a super job. Um, from a dealer perspective, they're always looking at how to make their show better. At the end of that particular show, they're saying, you know, what can we do to, to make it better than it was? Uh, once again, security is a great issue. That's a concern of all dealers. But um, the community shows up and there's a lot of activity on the, both the buy and the sell side. If um, someone has not gone to the Tyler Coin Show, I would highly recommend them, them going. They do a great job down there. Okay, everyone, we are here at the TNA Show in Arlington, Texas with Richie Self. Richie, can you introduce yourself and, Good morning. Uh, and your company? Yes, Richie Self, American Coins and Collectibles, Shreveport, Louisiana. Have you been to the Tyler Show? And if so, how has the Tyler Show treated you? Just your overall uh, thoughts on it, security, etc. I have been to the Tyler Show. Uh, it's one of the shows we really enjoy. Tyler is really strategically located. It's situated uh, pretty much between Shreveport and Dallas. So uh, you have a really great draw there from two states and the rural areas and the, and the big cities also. It's in a great facility. The guys that put it on do a fantastic job. They make everyone feel welcome. Really nice facility, uh, very good security. Uh, good public turnout and a diversified mix of dealers. It's one of the shows we look forward to. It's also one of the lo very low overhead shows for us. So we, we really like that aspect. So a big question that most people have when they're thinking about going to a show is what's going to be at the show? Uh, Mr. David, who runs the show, he assured us there's going to be lots of silver, lots of gold, uh, a lot of numismatic stuff, and possibly some coins for some kiddos that come along as well. I know that they have free emission. Um, and it's just going to be a really action-packed weekend. And the way that this coin show is a little bit different from other coin shows is that it's kind of uniquely placed between um, Louisiana and Texas, and there's a lot of Oklahoma dealers that come as well. And so there's a lot of shows that happen in Houston and happen in Dallas. But since Tyler's kind of, like I said, uniquely placed, a lot of those dealers never really come to those other shows. They really come to the Tyler show because it's run by a great gr group of guys that love the Lord and love their country. And another cool thing about this show is that every dealer there really is there to help you. They're always with a smile on their face. They're always willing to look at any collection that you might have. And we're gonna be there also. We want to sit down with you, talk with you about what you love about Newismatics and maybe what you love about the channel. I think that's something that would be great. And another cool thing is that they say the pledge and they also say the Lord's Prayer before starting the coin show. And I think that's pretty cool because um, we're just all there because we love our country and we love God. And I think that's something to be, uh, you know, something to keep a smile on our faces about. Now we're going to give you guys a brief overview of the details of the show. Make sure you guys show up early um, or show up when you can because there's going to be a lot of good deals when you come through the doors and then stuff that's going to be coming in midday, I'm sure. And like I said, everyone's there to greet you, talk about your collection, even show you some stuff for your collection if you wanted to buy some things. And Tyler is a pretty prosperous area as well, so there's not there's going to be a lot of you know safety procedures that are going to go into the show, and a lot of people are going to be there to buy and sell. And I mean, why don't you want to be at the coin show? I think it's going to be a good time. Yeah, but let's talk about those details. So last year after leaving the TNA show, we were kind of looking for something that was interesting and fun to go to and a smaller show. And the next show that we ended up going to was this Tyler show. And so 
we didn't really get too many big breaks. You know, there's some guys, there's some dealers that run into coins that, you know, profit them a good a good bunch or um, help them with their business. And so, over that period, we uh, were thinking about how we could innovate our business and do well. And the thing that we ended up doing is just making sure we were at every show as early as we could. And towards the end of the show, when we were at the Tyler show, we ended up running across this 1923 piece dollar rated MS63. Uh, and it is CEC approved. It's graded by NGC. And for all that don't know, this is um, an NGC white label. So they only use these, I think, for a few days or maybe a few weeks um, when they were starting to grade coins. And you can tell that it's a white label by just the white kind of uh, paper that's in there. But what I knew at the time and what somebody else didn't know, which was a dealer, is that basically these hold a lot of value with holder collectors. There's people that collect holders. And so we ended up spending uh, not too much on this on this coin and ended up profiting us very well and very nicely. And it's just something that really held a nice memory um, for us. And it really drawn us back to talking to the, to the people that organized the show, getting involved in the show, and just wanting more people to show up, wanting more people to uh, get involved in the space. Because I honestly do believe it's a great show, no matter if you get a big score or not. People are just there to buy and sell, but also really enjoy the hobby. And so that was our coin show experience for the, for the Tyler Coin Show. I hope you guys have a great experience as well when you go. Thank you guys for watching today's video. If you guys did enjoy today's video, please leave a like. We really want to see you at the Tyler Coin Show because like I said, it's a great place to meet a lot of nice dealers and a lot of great collectors. It's just uh, a show you really don't want to miss. It's a, it's a yearly show and I really do like it. Um, subscribe if you're new because we're coming out with videos every single week and we hope you guys had a great 4th of July, but we will see you guys in the next video.